Okay, let's ask him to play Marco Polo. Don't leave, PC9, please. How cute. He's like, he's swimming around, getting away from her. And she just splashed him. Oh. He's hiding under the water. He's hiding from you, Jill. Don't trust him. He's hiding. They're like on opposite sides of the pool. I'm like invested in this in this game right now. <laughs> Marco Polo. He's getting out. Oh, that little sneak. That little sneak. Look at him. He's getting out. You. You. <laughs> <laughs> he's so sneaky oh he's jumping back in she probably heard that splash you know that is so cute i'm actually so invested in the marco polo game i want to know who's gonna win hi guys and welcome back to yet another sims 2 i almost said pleasant view when am i gonna get over saying pleasant view sims 2 strange town stream in the last stream i think we played the beaker family which was super fun now we have moved on to the smith family so here's the smith house in case i get questions this house is by a lovely creator named fratana they make absolutely stunning houses and listen the smith family house is no different like look how beautiful this place is come on can we, can we just can we get a moment can we take a moment in this house i'll give a little grand tour here in a second we have pt9 who on the spreadsheet is called paul and that is because cindy who made the sims 2 strange town spreadsheet she renames him paul because polynesian technician is like his alien name i guess and so here he is i gave him a new face because pt9 is very uh scary to begin with holy jesus what is that? What the f is that? So I gave him a new face. I gave him like a genetically related face to his parents. If I go to his family tree, we can see he, his mom is Birth Queen, which is such a weird name. And his dad is Colony Drone 65535. So as you can tell, very alien-esque, extremely alien-esque. And so that's why Pleasant Sims calls him Paul. I probably will call him PT9, but he's a dad in the family. He has two kids named, oh no, he has four kids, sorry. He has Johnny and Jill with Jenny, <laughs> lots of J's. And then he also has two other kids with none other than Glarn Curious, who you may know as the Curious Brothers' dad, Curious Brothers'. Is. Thank you, Peony. I appreciate it for eight months. But yeah, he's the he's the alien. Apparently, the story is that he alien abducted Glarn, and that's how Glarn had Lola and Chloe. So if there's any confusion why he has other children, Chloe and uh, Lola, that is why. Okay, so moving on from him, he is old. I don't know if I'm gonna get him a job. He does want to become a oceanographer which is interesting. We can maybe do that. Oh, it's also, it's also to be mentioned. Yes, Emmy, his daughters are his sister-in-laws. So let me, let me, let me, let, let's think about that. His daughters, let's, let's get them out here. His daughters, Lola and Chloe are also his sister-in-laws. And if you're wondering, how is that possible? It's because Lola and Chloe's sister is Jenny, who is married to PT9. Do you see, do you understand, like, do we understand where this is weird? See, there's a lot of, there's, there's some moments of weirdness here in Strange Town. It's a, uh, it's a little, it's a little weird, but they're not blood related. So that's, that's, that's the takeaway here. <laughs> they're not blood related, but it is a little bit strange. You know, we are in Strange Town, so it makes sense. Okay, so the next sim in this household is Jenny. I think someone in chat said that she got yassified. I gave her a makeover. I gave all the sims in this town makeovers. Jenny, this is her face straight out the box. All I did was get, give her a new hair, give her some makeup, and this is what she looks like. Obviously, I've reshaded and stuff like that, but she's very pretty. She doesn't have a job, I don't think. Oh, she's a nurse. Okay, I didn't know that she had a, so she's a nurse level three. She has a super cute bio. When you brought this to my attention, Jenny loves having a career, but she wishes she could spend more time with her family and maybe make some new friends. She really likes the color green. Isn't that so sweet? Obviously that's like a, that's a nod to how her whole family is green. Like PT9 is green and their son Johnny is green. So it's super cute. She also has a wish to have a baby because she's a family sim, of course. And so she probably will. I do have a fertility curve, but I don't think that should affect her. She has 14 days till she becomes an elder. So we should be a-okay. I will, whenever I have a sim that has a want to have a baby, I will go ahead and have them try for a baby. Uh, otherwise, I'm just leaving it up to like ACR to give me a, a surprise risky woohoo baby. Last but not least, we have little Jill here 
One of you in chat said that you have Buck and Jill get together when they age up, obviously, and that would be super cute. We'll have to see like if their sexualities get rolled to be attracted to each other. But here's Jill. She's just, she's a little girl and she won't be aging up in this rotation. She'll still be a child by the end of this rotation, I think, because we're going to play, maybe not. She might be like one day before. I'm not sure. We'll have to see. Anyway, here is Jill's personality. She's super neat. She's very shy. She's kind of lazy, kind of active. She's pretty playful and she's in the middle of grouchy and nice. PT9 has a really similar personality. He's very neat. He's quite shy, very lazy, I guess. He's quite playful and he's in the middle of grouchy and nice. And Jill, I love Jill. Sorry, Jenny. I'm gonna get the J names mixed up. So if I'm on Jenny, but I say Jill, please know who i'm talking about it's just a lot of names to to you know spit off so she is in the middle of sloppy and neat she's a little bit shy a little bit lazy thank you dory for the sub of prime i appreciate it she's quite serious but she's very 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 nice so those are the three sims we're going to be playing today it's the smith family and they have a, I love that their house, someone also brought this to my attention, but they have the only green yard in the entire, entire town. And that is a nod to the bio, I think, yes. The only thing PT9 loves more than his lawn is his family. When he's not spending time with his children, he enjoys clipping coupons and staring up at the sky. So that's why he has a green lawn. Thank you also for the hydration, I appreciate it. You can actually roll Jill's sexuality, just go to the adjuster. Yeah, I'm not I'm not like pining to know what it is right now because it, does, it doesn't matter. Um, so I'll just wait for like ACR to do it itself. Someone asked me, how did you update their Maxis houses? Did you move them out? Yes, I did. I moved them out and into the Fratana house. If she's an elder in 14 days, isn't she like 46? I don't know, I guess I don't know. Yeah, I don't know how my aging system works either. <laughs> um, she probably would be like kind of old, but honestly, I I don't know. I just let my aging do whatever it wants. She says she's 26. Wait, Jenny says that she's 26? Brittany asks, oh yeah, I want to ask you something. I know you use a lot of custom wallets. Have you ever gotten a super duper hug bug from them? Does no sim loaded prevent it? Wait, what is super duper hug bug? I guess I've never got it to answer your question but uh i don't know what that is <laughs> okay they're gonna go and try for a baby we're gonna look away from them and we're gonna look at cute little jill over here who's dancing she's doing this muscle my sims are whatever age i tell them they are a past adulthood <laughs> exactly <laughs> yeah she doesn't tell us how old she really is she wants to be a cool young mom thank you for the fratana wreck by the way maddie it's been a dream since i restarted with my yeah they're super nice the houses are all what I like about Fratana's makeovers is they keep the general essence of the house. You know, like it goes, it still goes with PT9 and how he likes his lawn green, everything like that. It keeps the lore of the family, but just like upgrades the house and makes it look better, if that makes sense. They feel so lived in, cozy. Yes, I love it. Oh, it, it's a bug that sticks to lots. Make them, make Sims hug all the time. What? I didn't know that was a thing. No, I've never got that. Yeah, they, yeah, they're cuddling. Why don't you guys get up? It's like the middle of the day. <laughs> let's let's not sleep. Okay, so PT9 wants to get a job in oceanography. We can definitely do that. Shoot, did I just save without... Did I, I hit yes on that. I hope it saved it. I think it saves it when you hit yes, right? You can clean out the super duper hug bug with Chris Hatch Lot Cleaning Mod. That is a, that is a mouthful. Thank you. What happens when you get... I think they just... The, the hug animation just keeps queuing itself, but I've never gotten that. So, fingers crossed I don't get it. Anyway, I'm gonna get PT9 a job in oceanography. And to do this, oh, my game froze there for a second, a little bit freaky. To do this, I'm going to add a lot called at the office, which is just like a row of off. Actually, I don't know if this quite fits with the town. <laughs> I was gonna say, maybe I'll put this down, but it it kind of like industrializes the area. I don't like that. I don't like how it makes the, I don't like how it makes the world look. It makes it look like too, too city-like. So I'm going to just add, what I'm, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to add the job searching board. So you can have your Sims go to this lot and they can specifically pick a career to get a job. And obviously like, I know I can cheat it. I can choose whatever job I can, I want with Sim Blender, but 
I like the storytelling purposes of like a sim coming to a public lot, like going to the offices, the what's it called? The job searching offices and having to find a job. So we could just say that maybe this is the the strange town unemployment office. That's that's the word I'm looking for, the unemployment office. So I'm gonna go and add the custom content object. And I can kind of show how this works if you guys don't know. I gotta find it first. If I can find it, it's gonna be buried. I already know it's gonna be buried in all of my CC. Where is my job board? Here it is. But I feel like The Sims 2 like desperately needs a search function mod. And I think she, I think Lazy Duchess is actually working on it right now, if I am correct. Okay, so here is the job board. So obviously it looks oh, okay, wait, this has let me, let me make it simlish text because I don't like the English text on it. There we go. So here's the job board. I think they can use this. I hope that they can get to it. We'll see if we'll see if they can route to it. On the topic of lots, I might get for Tonos lots. Yeah, they're really good. They're really nice. They're super nice. I like them. Okay, let's go back to the Smith family. And we'll see if he can access that board. But anyway, that's that building, that mall that we just went to. We're just going to say that that's like the unemployment office, okay? Because really nothing's in there. There's not, there's not much in there. Not much in that mall. I mean, there's like clothing stores. Oh no, Jenny and Jill are sick. Do aliens not get the same sickness? I'm confused. I should also mention that we played with Johnny. I think it was the last stream or maybe a couple streams ago. So Johnny is PT9 and Jenny's son. If you guys didn't know, just, you know, gotta get all my bases. So we're gonna take the whole family to the mall. So I mentioned Jill's aspiration earlier. I believe she's a hidden popularity token. Buck does too. There might be others in Stranger. That's interesting. I always said Johnny, Ophelia, and Rip off to college together. Yeah, my um Johnny and Ophelia did not get a want to go to college. So they didn't go. If my sims don't want to go, then they don't go. Also, like they're kind of old. So I guess that's kind of why I didn't get the want. And PT9 is going to get a job in oceanography. Someone said that Jill's bio, was it Jill or was it Jenny? Points towards her wanting to be an oceanographer, which I think is really cool. I still learn new things about The Sims 2. Same, same. Let me read Jenny or Jill's bio. Once again, I'm gonna mess up Jenny and Jill, so be prepared, please. When Jill has, when Jill closes her eyes, she sees dolphins, that's cute. She has her heart set on becoming a deep sea welder someday, that's cute. Oh, look who's here. Is this Chloe? Chloe's here. So this is PT9's daughter. This is his alien abduction daughter. I'm gonna have him go say hi. So I feel like PT9 probably doesn't interact with like Chloe and Lola much. I don't know the logistics of that, but I just get that impression that he probably wasn't in their life very much growing up. Like look at his relationship with Chloe. It's 29 over 15 compared to his relationship with his daughter Je uh, Jill that he lives with. 43 over 20, you know what I'm saying? So it's it's a tough situation. He probably didn't he probably didn't raise them much, as most of the alien parents don't. They don't really raise their kids much in my games, at least. Okay, let's have PT9 go over to the job board. And we just click on it, and he can just find a job in oceanography. It looks like Jenny already knows where she's going. She's she's over here in the in the unemployment office. I'm gonna have her go. We can work as a barista, which is so funny. Oh, Jill's here too. What are you doing, Jill? We should, oh my gosh, that does scare me. Thank you, Sky. We will have them do a try for baby when they get home. Yeah, try for baby is back. I have decided it is back. Okay, so PT9, 47 simoleons a day. As a fish chummer. That is his job title, fish chummer. All right, so there we go. He's got a new job. And he's cat calling his wife, of course. And he wants to get a kitten and a puppy. Anyone else want to get an animal? No, just PT9. What is that? What? What? What is happening? She's throwing a tantrum. Oh, her aspiration's really low. Why is her aspiration so low? Hold on a second. Let me look. Oh, because Vidkun, who are her uncles? Yeah, her uncles Vidkun got abducted by aliens, I guess. And it was something that she did not like. Johnny is not in the household anymore. Oh my god, Jenny is hacking up a lung. We need to get home and have some comfort soup. I think she feared having a party, which Johnny had last time. Wait, that's so interesting. She feared having a party. I didn't know that that, that was like a fear. Oh, we're here. Have a party. She fears it. She does not like parties. Even though she has a hidden popularity token, according to someone in chat. King Callisto. 
or she's been in the desert so long she wants to be by the ocean says king Callisto. that's what that's what jill wants she always fears it so she always goes to an aspiration failure after the scripted oh that sucks she's gonna grow up and like <laughs> not have the best grow up which is sad oh no pt9 has work like now shoot he's gonna be a little bit late actually no he won't he's gonna get back at 2 30 and you just walk to work so we'll be we'll be good okay here we go here we go here we go he's coming back all right let's have him walk to work quickly and then we're gonna have to do sky's try for baby that she did when he gets home he's going to work in his swimwear very fitting <gasps> oh no jenny wants to woo with three different sims oh no oh <laughs> Okay, so Jenny, I believe, is secondary. Yeah, she's secondary romance. Ah, that's tough. Yeah, Jenny's gonna be a cheater. Oh no. Yeah, we were all rooting for you. Who do we have? <laughs> Everyone in this town is like, oh, I know, I know somebody. <sighs> I know somebody. General Buzz Grunt incoming. Okay, um. Aww. All right, General Buzz. General Buzz incoming. I know, it's not Jenny at all. I think her secondary aspiration, if you do the aspiration calculator, is, is romance, though. So, yeah, General Buzz, y'all. General Buzz. He's the only single sim I can think of. There he is. There's, I was like wondering where the phone is. She got tired of being a good girl. <laughs> She could actually be pregnant right now because she just woohooed with her husband. Try her baby. So Jill is just throwing a tantrum. Okay, well, I'm sorry, Jill, but wait, where is... Oh, it can be Loki too. We could have her woohooed Loki. Nah, General Buzz is the move. General Buzz is out working. Okay, Buck. That was very rude of you to say. General Buzz. I think she's already pregnant though, Sky. So I don't know if you want me to wait until she gives birth to her and PT9's baby or what because you're trying baby i don't want it to go to waste if that makes sense wait till she gives birth okay so we'll like we'll work on the relationship of p uh pt i'm <laughs> no general buzz and jenny and we'll see if she even is prego check if she is Let's, we can check where is my acr let's see if i have it on this lot um also please tell me if the music gets too loud please tell me all the songs in this playlist are different volumes and someone last time was like maddie your music was too loud i'm like sorry i didn't know i had no idea i'm gonna change the spawner to a rose bush i'm gonna move it in the backyard and we can check if she is pregnant um oh she's not she's not pregnant Wow, I, I was half expecting her to be pregnant. Okay, well, <laughs> now I guess we can move ahead and yeah, have gen her and General Buzz have a little side side romance, I guess. I, I was really expecting her to be pregnant because I did a try for a baby. Interesting. Okay, adult. We're going to chat with an adult. Okay, General Buzz. <laughs> Nervous and Cersei are on here and Crystal Vu but not General Buzz. I mean, the aspiration calculator gives me a result I don't vibe with. I recognize that the council has made a decision, but given that it's stupid ass decision, I'm looking to ignore it. Same. Don't torture Jenny with Loki's horrible genes. It'd be too obvious that she was cheating with that brow bone anyway. General Buzz is actually a really handsome guy. I'm gonna have her make some dinner for me. We're gonna have some comfort soup because everyone's just in a bad mood. Oh, Stranger Than Sin Fiction, thank you for the raid. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Miss Jenny here just got a wish to uh, cheat on her husband, unfortunately. What? 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 What is the problem? She had to get a she had to get a spoon out. She couldn't get the spoon. Welcome everyone. I wish I could log in multiple wishes at the same time. Okay. PT9 is home. 47 simoleons, a whopping 47 simoleons. He wants to invite someone over. Oh, <laughs> Jill's coming out to hug her dad. Oh, adorable. She wants to play computer games. We can go do that. Oh my gosh, that scared me. Thank you, Veronica, for the posture check. Set up straight, I promise. I think it's weird. Second romance aspirin calculator has interest equal health. Has interest in health equal romance aspiration. Like why? Oh, is that true? I didn't know that. I didn't know that, that was like the correlation. 
All right, everyone, come in, uh, eat some dinner. Save? We're going to save? Okay, I'll save. Jill trying to calm down after hearing your mom wanting to cheat on Paul. I know. Hydration. Thank you. I'll do a hydration right now. <clears throat> it's dinner time. I'm going to get some dinner. We're all sick. We need some comfort soup. Jenny's uh, bladder is going down really low. I, 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 oh my god, she just got sick immediately. <laughs> she gets unsick and then she gets re-sick. Amazing. Anyway, I was gonna say, her, her stuff is going down super slow or super fast, guys. I have a hard time believing she's not pregnant, to be honest. Look at Jill's room. It's so pink. It's so girly. I love it. Oh, look at this. <gasps> oh, look at that crystal, crystal wall. I've never seen this before. That's fascinating. I like that. I'm gonna use this in my houses now. <laughs> Even though I don't make houses, but you know, if I did, <laughs> my my renovations. All right, we're gonna go to sleep. And Jenny's wolfing down some soup. I'm gonna have PT9, just put this away. Go take a shower and probably head off to bed. I'm going to have Jenny try and call over General Buzz. Maybe we can say, hey, I have a recipe for you. Maybe she can be like, well, we know we know what she's after. <laughs> but maybe she can like use his dead wife or his yeah, his dead wife, right? His his wife is passed. Can I knowing him, he's gonna bring over like his son or something. Oh, this is a good idea. If he brings over one of his sons. Maybe we can say like, hey, my kid wants to meet your kid at 9 p.m. at night as though my daughter is not asleep. Okay, whatever. What if it's Buck? If it's Buck, that'd be so perfect because then Jill can meet Buck and that'd be fun. All right, come on. Where are you, General Buzz? Where are you at? Buzz hates aliens, so he'd probably be happy making Paul's wife cheat. <laughs> Wait, who is this? Is this the sim? Where? Okay. Um, Here's General Buzz. Wait. Who are, who are you having come over? What? Is this your friend? Wait, I don't know that. Hold on. You need to leave. I don't know who this is. Please, please leave my house. I don't know who you are. One of the townies. All right. We're just going to talk to General Buzz now. She's like, leave. Goodbye. <laughs> okay. So PT9 is going to bed. He's going to sleep. Wait, why can't he sleep? I think he can't sleep because he's not that tired yet. Okay. Well... Oh, is he gonna yell at him? Be slapped. Really? Really? I, you just got here. <laughs> PT9 hates General Buzz. PT9's gonna be like, why did you invite General Buzz over here? Why did you invite why did you invite him over here, Jenny? Okay, these two are just gonna come over and talk to each other. She wants to ask us him out on a date. Oh my gosh, I'm scared. Oh no, Poke. He's going up to poke him. <laughs> oh no. Jenny's here to foster friendships between everyone in town. And it's very clear that PT9 is just not a... He's not about that. He doesn't want that. Yeah. It's more likely to bring a random townie than a household member. I hate that. Suck face. Oh my gosh, Jenny. Really? In front of General Buzz and all that? Buzz is already wearing green. Yes, he is. What is he doing? I hate this face paint he has on. I really do hate it. I'm going to change it. Hold on. I know it's like his signature. Y'all, I get it. But we can, you know, appreciate it for what it was. And move past. I think she was friends with Lila, Buzz's ex-wife. Oh, is that true? I didn't know that. Okay, let's get this face paint off him. He's a very handsome guy, actually. He is very handsome. He's very good looking. All right, put aside that he hates aliens and, you know, he's prejudiced towards them. He's a good looking dude. He is. Let me add some wrinkles to him because he's supposed to be like in his 50s, right? Okay, there we go. I added some wrinkles to his face. Hopefully that makes him look older. Admire. She's admiring him already. Did he accept the... Oh, he accepted it. All right. Um, I kind of want to ask him out on a date, but I don't know if that's going to... Is that a romantic interaction? I mean, it has to be, right? I don't want her to do it right in front of her husband. That's the thing. Chat. Okay, she's just chatting with him. Maybe we'll go through a redemption arc. <laughs> yeah, he, uh... I don't know. 
this is this is gonna be interesting i wish i could lock multiple wishes in. i need like a mod that allows me to lock multiple in because i would like to lock this one in and this one but i can't have both of them locked okay so we're gonna have her go ahead and ask him on a date we're not gonna go anywhere though i'm gonna keep them here but yeah, her woohoo era begins i don't know if I, I hope it doesn't trip off pt9 he's sleeping though so i don't think it should right oh he's hitting on her <laughs> he's already attracted to her this is so messed up y'all this is so messed up okay let's go and have them chat i'm gonna talk you can add a lock with a bat box oh <gasps> what i think my wands already got re-rolled though Th did they just get re-rolled yeah they already got re-rolled damn it um where is it at where is it at where is it at wants uh no make me fix no upgrade sim no nuke no you can add a want log oh is it sim blender not not um that box okay let's add a want log add want lock there we go okay so next time she gets the try for or the baby want we can uh we can have her do that that should be good okay cool what her his wonk got stuck with that what is that okay there we go oh he's not liking what we're saying she wants to tell a dirty joke to him all right let's just keep let's just keep joking oh my gosh they're not getting along oh no he does want to dance with her so we'll try that if i ever Maddie see that i'm sorry she'd probably have a degree as a nurse okay i can give her a degree i mean that makes sense let's add a uh biology degree we'll have to do biology there's really nothing no other option they're all still buzz wants though we can oh 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 they just fell in love not in love but now they have a crush on each other oh my goodness oh my goodness this feels so icky i feel so bad for pc9 oh no i know poor paul okay let's go and have <gasps> casual sit y'all they're <laughs> oh no she's so brazen about it he's literally they're literally right out here y'all they're literally right out here wait oh my gosh okay they stopped i don't know why they why did they stop okay well sky has sky renamed to try for baby so we gotta have them kiss first this is so messed up i feel so bad for paul i do i know i feel so conflicted i do i mean on the bright side pt9 is kind of old so you know <laughs> that's one thing but then on the other side like he doesn't deserve this hot tub i know she's a horrible she's a horrible person i you know her bio says that she's a loving mom but that that romance that romance sim trait man it is just it's crazy i know not her husband's leaving i know that's what i'm saying that's what i'm saying her husband is literally in the next room i don't want to do it what if we do it like on johnny's old bed <laughs> ew i'm dying okay he's coming up he's already coming up he already knows look he's following her if jenny has a kid then if jill and buck get together they'll already share a half sibling yeah that's that's gonna be a common thread in this town is what you just said there's gonna be a lot of like weird connections like for example jenny is pt9's sister-in-law or whatever it was so all right uh casual try for baby is that gonna work let's see if that works sometimes they cancel it out like 50 times nope okay that's perfect all right pt9 doesn't know a thing he's fast asleep he is fast asleep so there's your try for baby sky hopefully your try for baby does something because jenny wants to woohoo with three different sims we're doing this with someone yeah i know it's it's so wrong to be doing to her own son okay so there we go they have their woohoo um it's hailing outside i thought she was waking up because <laughs> she heard something <gasps> okay y'all you you cannot be cuddling and sleeping we we this is this is messy get up get out of bed please get out of the bed get out of the bed get out of the bed 
Georgetown is known for its convoluted family trees. Yeah, I can. I, I get the. I get the gist of that. I do. I feel it. Kick him out. Walk of shame. She wants to keep kissing him and stuff like that. So we can give a kiss. Uh, I'm gonna have him. I'm gonna try and have him have a dream date. I just need to make sure PT9 does not wake up. Oh my gosh, his his thing is full. We need to make. We need. We need Buzz to leave. We need Buzz to leave. She wants to make out with three different sims too. I'm gonna lock that one in as well because we can do that. If they're if they're gonna woohoo, then we can have them make out. I think when PT9 does wake up, he will he will know. Maybe I don't know. I forget how the sim the cheating system in Sims works. Sims to it, it's different in every game, which is kind of weird that they didn't make like a common denominator cheating system. But whatever. Propose, move in. Are you out of your mind, Jenny? She is out of her mind. Wake him up. No. I refuse. I don't know how it's on a dream day. I don't know. She wants to hug him. I'm trying to do some of the wishes that she wants to do so we can have it be a dream date. We're so close, y'all. We're so close. Hopefully PT9. Okay, PT9 is still sleeping. I got to keep like checking to make sure they're still sleeping. All right, there we go. Now it's a dream date. So I'm going to go ahead and we're going to end the date. Oh, oh no. Oh no, oh no. Oh no, she just vomited. Well, oh no. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh gosh, <laughs> I'm scared. Whose is it? It's, got, it's gotta be the only one. Okay, can you leave my house please? Goodbye. Yeah, look at the time, you better go. Oh no, <laughs> ACR check. No, it's it's definitely it's definitely general buzzes because we we did the ACR check after her and PT9 woohooed and it was negative. So his old heart wouldn't be able to take it. I know it's so sad. I feel bad. I do feel bad, but I'm playing one space. Like this is what my sim wants to do. So how should not tired? So whenever you get a dream date in Sims 2, it boosts their motives like super high. That's how. Also going to ban, oh, I keep grabbing the stereo. I'm gonna ban all critters from this lot. <clears throat> that got me scared. I thought I heard the boing in game. Do you have the mod that makes the husband realize a child is not his? Um, I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't think so. Because I mean, that would ruin like a lot of storylines and stuff. So I don't think I do. ET9 does not know. Oh. He wants to cuddle his grandson, Blackwell. That's so cute. All right, Jenny's off to work. She's not even so remotely tired. She's actually in a great mood today and she has a lot of general buzz wants. <laughs> Just wants to meet someone new. Can I lock a third one in? No, I can't. I feel like I should be able to lock in like as many as I want like that. Ooh. Oh no. Oh no, the flowers are there. So I do have a mod that makes it, if they see the flowers, I think it does like register so i'm gonna delete them because we don't want we don't want this to find out oh right i do have that mod yes i have that mod it is only if the husband has a high logic skill yes he's taking care of jenny or jill i meant jill no not jenny uh jill wants to jump rope so jill jump rope ah so many j's i can't i can't I can't talk get him to the chest table all right, she's gonna jump rope before school. PT9 doesn't have work until 3 p.m. So I assume we're gonna be doing a lot of speed threeing because he's an elder, so he's kind of boring to play. No offense, but you know, elder is not, not the most fun. Um, He doesn't have many skills actually. Cooking is his highest skill. He has no logic skill at all. Good night, Sky. He's cleaning the toilet. <clears throat> they both have yeah general buzz is a very good looking guy he is very good looking so hopefully they'll have less genetics he's also spying on people who's it gonna be i think it's laszlo right it's always laszlo maybe oh it's it's vidkun <laughs> vidkun is who he's spying on right now j name for the baby we could break the streak and uh do it in the naming convention that ea did with all the J names. 
He gained a logic skill point. <laughs> Maybe he'll find out about Jenny because he just gained a logic skill point. Got some bills. I'm gonna have him go down to the computer and pay those bills. Oh, we got a call. Who is it? I can't believe Jenny went and got herself pregnant by the guy that her husband absolutely hates with every fiber of his being. That is so messy. <laughs> Vidkun is this strange town designated telescope pusher. I like that. I wasn't sure who it was. I thought it was Laszlo, but yeah, it's Vidkun. Oh, he just. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> He's like, why are you looking at me in the telescope? Oh! PT9's got a little bit of bite. He's got a, he's got, he's got a, ooh. He's yelling at us. He's got a little bit of old, old man bite. Bye Gwen, have fun at the beach. I think I'm gonna adopt a kitten because he wants to get a kitten, so. Are you building the house? No, 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 no. I did not build these houses. No, no, no. They're by Fratana's makeovers on Tumblr. What is he doing? Lounge. See, this is what I'm saying, like, mm, elders are just not... We experienced this with the oldies in Pleasant View. They're just, they're just not the fun, that fun to play. Hi, standard gaming girl. How are you? All right, I'm going to call for services and we're going to adopt a kitten. Anyone else want a kitten? No, just PT9. I don't know what we should name the kitten. Hmm. <clears throat> It can stop your brother. Just the same thing with his telescope. No, literally. All right, pet adoption service. We're going to get a cat. Look at Allegra. We have bonkers. <laughs> I like bonkers. Bailey. Simi. I want I want bonkers. That's such a cute name. Genius. He's halfway between. Or is it? What is it? Is it a boy or a girl? I don't know. What is this symbol? It's a girl, right? A female? I think so. Genius, independent, halfway between aggressive and cowardly, and finicky. So, oh, it's a boy. I can't. I can never tell with a symbol. I've never got the uh, super hug bug. No, I can't tell. But anyway, okay. So bonkers it is. <laughs> I think it's so cute. You have to carry puppies and get it is cute, but it, it makes sense. But it's annoying. It is annoying to be honest, but it's cute. He's watching a, child, a child's movie about fairies. Oh, okay. Uh, so bonkers. We're gonna keep his name. I made the oldies townies. Honestly, that's a good idea. Oh, he wants to buy a pet bowl now so we can get that. Yeah, I don't like elders. I don't like playing elders. Every time I play an elder, I'm just waiting for them to, you know, bite the dust, honestly. He's very, um, he's very, he really wants to see Johnny and Ophelia get married, I think. Okay, PT9 has work in an hour. I'm going to give him another wants slot, like you guys said, with the Sim Blender. Because I want unlimited, like, want locks. I mean, if a sim rolls a want, like, I should be able to lock it in, right? I mean, that would just make sense. It doesn't really make sense. I mean, I don't, I don't see the, oh, I just, I just re-rolled his wants on accident. I clicked the wrong button. Can I add, like, I, I re-rolled them again. I keep misclicking. Add a want lock, add a want lock. Can I just add, like, unlimited amounts of want locks? Yes, I can. Okay, cool. All right, there we go. He rolled the same one that I had before. Anyways, I was going to say, he really wants to see Ophelia and Johnny get married, which I think is really cute. That's his son. Praise for staying off furniture. <clears throat> what does Sin Blender do? I have a video about it. It's called the Ultimate Controller Mons. It's a whole video I have. It goes into better detail, but it gives you like, it gives you access to do things in the game that you normally wouldn't be able to do like Kind of developer tools if that makes sense things you normally wouldn't be able to access <laughs> emmy oh my gosh i started a retirement home i had a 
our retirement home in, in Strange Town. It's just, it's still like, I, I would still have to theoretically play through them. Oh my gosh, no, don't, don't go to work yet. No, not yet, not yet, not yet. You need to put the kitty inside. The kitty has to go inside, sir. All right, Jenny just got home. She's gonna, she's gonna get her bump like any second now. He just hit on, he just had love hearts over his head for the driver of the car. Oh, she's vomiting. Oh, and Nervous is here. Why is Nervous here? <laughs> Why is Nervous at my house? Nervous, what are you doing? He's stealing my newspaper, my old newspaper. And then the last, Nervous! Buddy, what are you doing, buddy? Okay, bye, Nervous. Jenny, Jenny has such bad motives right now. Look at her mood. It's so low. She needs to sleep is what she needs to do. She didn't sleep last night. She just, she was running off pure adrenaline. I could lie. I have in the past just she had Coral cheated and Herb stays. Wait, not gonna lie. I have in the past just cheated Coral and Herb's days forward until Herb kicks it. Um. Oh, Joel wants to bring home. Yes. Oh my gosh, she brought home Buck. Here he is. I love his little sandals. She's running home. She got good grades, I think. Go show your mom. Wait, why are you sleeping in dust? Uh, Dustin. I just called Johnny Dustin. My goodness in johnny's old room what are you doing my girl i'm giving her more want locks too i can't stand this i can't stand it why can't i have unlimited wants add want lock add want lock add want lock add want lock i'm being very careful with my clicks this time there we go now i have three wants locked and another one she wants to go on a date too and she wants to meet a new sim look at that she's like signing me up or setting me up for um meeting someone else but she needs to go to sleep first. Like, she is so tired. Mm. Wait, what? What? Oh, it's because she woohooed in this bed. She keeps going up here to sleep here. <sighs> Get out of bed, Jenny, so I can clear your adjuster, please. She hasn't gotten any bump yet, which I'm a little... A little nervous. Nervous subject. All right, Jill is chilling and playing some computer games. She loves games. She's going to grow up and be one of us. <laughs> She's going to grow up and love The Sims, love video games, love EA games, that whole thing. If the baby has brown hair, it'll be obvious it isn't Paul's. Hmm. Well, maybe he won't ask questions. Maybe he won't even be here. Who knows? He might not even be here. Okay. Oh my gosh, I didn't feed, up, feed the kitty bowl. I gotta, I gotta go and um, do that. So he has food. Bonkers. Recessive. Yeah, it could be recessive genes. Like. Okay. They want to play Marco Polo. That's so cute. Let's, let's go, go, go. Let's go play Marco Polo. Come on. Can I ask Buck to join the, the game? Let's see. I think I have to wait till she's in the water, right? This, this would this would be so fun. Just having this giant pool and having your friend just hang out. All right. Ask to play Marco Polo. Here we go. Oh my gosh. I've never done this before. Let me see. He's taking the slide down to play some Marco Polo with us. Can I take the slide? Let's see how fun this is. Wee! All right. Go play Marco Polo together. She's calling Marco. And look at they closed their eyes. Her eyes are closed. <laughs> This is so cool! Oh my gosh, she like doesn't know where he is. Wait, why'd you stop? Play it again, play it again. Ask to play Marco Polo. Marco! <laughs> He's just swimming around trying to get away from her. I used to love to play this game when, when I was a kid. Marco! <laughs> Does she ever... I guess she doesn't... They don't do it for very long. They don't play for very long. Find him. Oh, she's got to do her homework now. All right, it's homework time. That was cut short. <laughs> Jenny feverishly taking a brown shower. We had old family photos, yeah. All right, I need to get her up. I'm going to have her serve up some dinner, some spaghetti for everybody. That PT9 take a little bath. Why are you mad at me? Go clean yourself up. She's got to go and do her homework for the night. I'm going to buy her a better computer. I like how it's pink too. Was that clean UI though? What do you mean? 
Do I have clean UI? Yes, I do. I don't know if that's what you're asking. Is this a normal computer? This is like the Sims 4 battle station thingy. I want a pink computer. Where are my pink computers at? Buck when he sees a new Smith baby. Why does that baby look like my dad? <laughs> oh no. Hopefully, listen, I'm hoping he won't recognize it. You know, is there no pink computers? I'm sad. There's no pink computers, whatever. I'll just get that one. Oops. Honestly, Jill is lucky enough to be like 10 years old and have a computer in her bedroom because that was not the norm for a lot of us. She's doing her homework. I guess it's about ice creams and watermelons. Now she's like reading it with her finger. Ice cream and watermelons. What could her homework be about? I don't know. Oh, someone's getting yelled at. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, he's 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 mad at Vidkun. Why did you go up all the way to your daughter's room to be mad at Vidkun like that? I don't know. I've been researching to save Jenny's life and her grandmother, Annie, had brown hair. So it's all good. Yay. <laughs> Jenny, you're saved, my girl. Not Kitty, though. That's her mom, but above Kitty. That's interesting. It's my first time here and so far I'm having a good time. My only question is why Sims 2 instead of Sims 3 or 4? I had no problem with it, so please don't think. Uh, I play Sims I play Sims 3. I play Sims 3 a lot. I just played Sims 3 on Saturday, last Saturday. I did a whole series about Sims 3 as well. I definitely play Sims 3 a lot. I mean, the UI doesn't look vanilla. Yeah, it's it's a clean UI. Sims 2 clean UI. Is Vidkun wearing the same shirt as Paul? I don't think so. I think they're it kind of has like a lower shirt like a v-neck like a deep v shirt on jeff for a baby name or jess or judy j name plus has four letters like buzz tank rip and buck Ooh, the nod to the four letter names is really interesting for me i like that i do like that maybe jeff or judy i don't like jeff jeff gives me like 45 year old dad kind of name jack could be cute oh i like jack if it's a boy jack i like that a lot jack and jill oh, jack and jill oh that is so cute jack and jill we'll definitely do jack and jill jenny should get her bump like any time now it's been about 24 hours she's been i mean she's been um woohooed since so I can't have her sleep though. Her sleep schedule is like very messed up. It's like backwards. Oh, she's trying to crest PT9. Okay, well, he went to bed, honey. Jane. Or Jade. Oh, Jade, since Jenny loves green, that is so cute. Oh, she's playing with the kitty. Oh, we need to buy him a litter box. Oh my gosh, that is so mean that I did not buy him a litter box. Oops. Oops. Yeah, I gotta do that. I have to buy kitty stuff. I forgot I had to buy kitty stuff. I had like no stuff for the kitty. We'll get him a litter, litter, a little litter box. That is hard for me to say. Little, little. When I was a kid, I had a I had a, I had hard times with my R's and my L's. Hard time. That was hard for me to say as well. Where am I going to put this? I got to put it somewhere where the kitty can get to it. <laughs> Everything is just got, all right, right here. He can get to it, I think. Jesse, it's got to be a four letter name. It's not gonna have the problem. Yeah, Ophelia's puppy was just peeing everywhere. That was not fun. Can you go to sleep? Yeah, she can go to sleep now. Amazing. Okay. Any second now, she'll get her bump. Any second. Any second. I'm waiting for it. Who is. Oh no. Oh no. Buzz. Buzz, sir, you should not be leaving me a TV. You don't have the finances to do that, Mr. Buzz. PT9 is just going to wake up and be like, why is there a giant TV on my doorstep? <laughs> so if you answered this, but did you renovate this house? This is by Fratana's makeovers on Tumblr. I did not make this house. No. Buzz got that riz. He's down bad. Yes, he is. Oh, 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 I think it's time. I think she's going to get her bomb. Yes. Yay. There it is. Okay. So we got to go over to PT9. Oh, he's like, he's wolf whistling her. Let's see. Um, can you like 
I think she has to be further along. I really wish that the baby interactions were open up from like, were open until from day one of her being pregnant, if that makes sense. They're talking about Ophelia. Don't gossip about Ophelia, that's so mean. Okay. Let's see, Do, have I have them make out? I don't know if I have. I'm trying to like complete some of her wishes down here. So let's just have them make out. Yeah, a whole TV. Jenny must have that good. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, <laughs> Jenny has the night off because she has maternity leave. Congratulate. Why are you congratulating? Oh, because the game is recognizing that they moved to a new house. Oops. I shouldn't have moved them out, probably. I mean, there's no other way I could have had them move out. Oh, we could do a gender prediction. Thank you. Yes. Oh, so I added a brand new feature, by the way, on Twitch. People on the YouTube video replay should be able to see the gender prediction. I always like am talking about, oh, you guys can predict the gender, whatever you think it is in chat. Um, but I think the YouTube peoples should be able to see it now. Uh, will Jenny's baby be a boy or a girl? We're gonna start this. Did it work? Yay, it worked. Look at that. It's kind of covering chat a little bit though, so I might move it just a touch. It may be making it a little bit smaller. You guys, there's a little sound effect now too. I'm gonna move it like up here. How about that? We'll put it up at the top right. That might be a better place for it. <clears throat> First time participating in a, in a prediction. Let's go, yay. I spent 30 socks on this. What's winning? So you guys, more of you think it's gonna be a boy. Oh, wow, disproport. Someone just put in 5K socks. Wow. Lots of, lots of boy predictors in chat. You guys must have some insight that I don't. So this is just a reminder if you're if you're just popping into to the stream. This is General Buzz Grunt's baby. This is not PT9's baby. No, 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 it is not. Use my intuition on 5,000 songs. All right, let's have Jenny put all this away. I'm so convinced of this. We'll see, we'll see. I'm excited. I want her to give birth already. I might like put on speed three for a couple days because I kind of, I just want to, I want to, I want to see the baby. I want to see what it's going to each up to look like too. The parents are both very good looking. So I have, I have high hopes. Okay, it's time for school, Jen, uh, Jill. See, I'm going to get all the names mixed up. I think we've had a lot of girls in Strange Town so far, right? Let me check the spreadsheet. So, okay, so Cersei and Loki had, um, no, Loki's alien baby was a girl, and the Beaker's biological baby was also a girl. Blackwell was a boy, Tycho obviously a boy, and Astra was a girl. So we've had really evenly, you know, two girls, two boys. It's been very even so far as, as far as the births in this town, which is really nice because my Pleasant View has a major boy population and it is to the point where it's going to not everyone's gonna have a partner basically but also like personally i find that the girls in this game are so much more fun to play than the boys like let's be real personally at least jenny with quads would i wouldn't actually be too close off to that i would actually like that because that would allow us to have a good set of genetics <laughs> Because whatever child the beakers have is automatically gonna look a little bit funky because of Loki's eyebrows. He just has that really insane brow bone. So any way that we can improve the genetics in this town, I'm down for. <laughs> Buzz gonna have a heart attack when Jenny has quads. We'll see. She might not have a heart, uh, heart have a heart attack. I was reading your message. She might not have quads. <laughs> You're gonna have the stream on in the background when you dye your hair. I wish you luck. I wish you luck, crow. <gasps> oh, Jenny received child support from Buzz. Can I turn that off? She would not tell him. There is no way she would ever tell him. I can't turn it off. I cannot turn it off until I think she gives birth. I can't turn it off. Or maybe she told him. And, no, she would not tell him. There's no way she would tell him at all. I think I can go adjust her. No, I have to have, I have to be clicking on the baby. Jenny's tired again. She's always tired. I kind of want her to like go out to the... Okay, Vidkun's here. Why are you here, Vidkun? Hello? Why did he just run up? Oh, is he mad at PC9? 
bad all see that. You think Jenny knows? No, I don't think she would know. I don't think she would know. It's maternity pay. Yeah, it's maternity pay. Not child support. <laughs> you're not dyeing your hair, but your mom is ready. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Why is Buzz sending us money? Jenny nervously laughs. <laughs> I got look at bonkers sleeping on the floor. He's so cute. Great cat, great cat, great cat. Oh, he's so cute. Wait, who was hitting on who? Was it PT9? Just okay. I hope it was PT9 hitting on Jenny. Redkin's just chilling out. Okay, um, I'm gonna move this TV. So, oh, he's trying to use it. He's trying to watch it when it's like on the porch. Okay, PT9. I don't know what Jenny would tell him as far as why they have just a random TV. I think that maybe she'd be like, oh, haha, I ordered it online on accident. I clicked the wrong button. And PC9 would be like, why did you buy that? That was hundreds of dollars down the drain, Jenny. Maybe it might be a little bit of conflict for those two. I don't know. I'm trying to find a place to put this. There we go. Put it right there. It could might be warning Paul. You think he knows something? Hold on, we're getting a phone call. Man, if Paul dies of old age, wonder if Buzz would swoop in and propose to her. I don't know. Someone in the chat said that Lila was... Maybe it was you, King Calisto. Uh, is Jill... No, why are you calling my... Y'all. Laszlo is never gonna beat those weirdo rumors. Like, he never will. He's he's always he's, he's always gonna be a weirdo. Why is he wanting to talk to a 10-year-old child? I'm not gonna read into it, but this is not helping Laszlo's case in our pleasant view or our, our strange town. No, my my ten year old daughter is not available, Laszlo. Leave me alone. <laughs> also, thank you, love yourself for sub it here when I appreciate it. Yeah, Laszlo is just being a weirdo. He's just being a weirdo. So that's that. Oh, it's his niece. Okay, I mean that it. Okay. <laughs> I guess I didn't put it together. <laughs> I forgot that that was his niece. Listen, there's too many close connections. I will never remember anything in this town. Okay, PT9's going to work in an hour. He's hanging out with Vidkun, who's in his Speedo. Love that for us. Just watching a movie together. Jenny is... Oh, Jenny just jumped in his arms. She's oh, she wants to be best friends with General Buzz. <gasps> wait a second. Oh, wait, this is okay. I just I forgot that Jenny is their sister. And I was like, wait, she came with Vidkin. No, 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 no. That is her sister. Oh man. I just I just forget. Like they don't look alike to me. Alright, PC9, time for you to go to work, buddy. It's gonna be We're gonna have a hard time finding another guy in town. For Jenny to woohoo with. Like, it's gonna be hard because she wants another sim to um, woohoo with. <clears throat> so let's see. Let's see if we can. Oh, AJ! AJ's a perfect. She already has two bolts with him. Okay, perfect. Let's. Okay, first of all, we need to ask her brother to leave. Goodbye. We can go leave my house. Goodbye. And we can invite AJ over. So AJ is like the town. He's like the town womanizer, honestly. I think that's like his shtick is like he's a romance sim and he gets around a lot. AJ would be perfect though. So we're gonna line him up, y'all. We're gonna line him up. We're gonna invite over AJ and line him up. AJ is like the only person I can think of in Strange Town that is not related to her that is a man. <laughs> there's not a lot. There's not a lot. Yeah, like there's probably, I mean, Loki is the last option, I think. Like, genuinely, Loki is the last option that out of the guys she knows, at least. Oh no, Jill is home. Oh, Jill, really? She's ruining it. I was gonna, <laughs> I was gonna have Jenny make her move. Well, okay, here's the thing. She wants to meet someone new, so that will complete that wish. And she wants to ask someone out on a date. We could have her meet him and then ask him to leave and then call him on the phone and be like, hey, do you want to go out on a date? Oh, wait, she already knows him. What am I saying? Meet someone new. She already knows him. Okay, so we'll say goodbye to him. And then I'm going to have her call him on the phone. And we'll have them go out to a public lot together. 
Yeah, townies could be an option. I'm just not too fond of townie face. The townie, I mean, I guess I have default face templates, but I like the premates because they all have stories and stuff. That's why I like premates more than townies. Damn it, Jill, how dare you come home from school? I know. Come on, Jill. She ruined it. Uh, what was I doing? Ask out on date. That's what we want to do. All right, we're going to ask him on a date, community lots. I feel like it's like, why are you, why can't I see you anymore? Um, there's no one to, yeah, we can hire a babysitter. So we kind of got to make this a little bit snappy because she is pregnant. So I don't want her pregnancy timer to not advance while she's on a public lot because it will not, her pregnancy will be not advancing. I think that's how that works in the Sims 2 when she's out on a public lot. So we got to kind of make this snappy a little bit. Yeah, AJ and Aaron, that would have been cute, but I don't think he likes Aaron. Like, I don't... Have I saved recently? I have not. Let me save right now. Thank you for reminding me, suburban mother. I appreciate it. All right, we're going to have her head off. And looks like the nanny is finally here. Yeah, thank you for the save. It's the same driver every time. What's up with that? All right, we're out. So we're gonna, we got to make this really quick because I don't want her uh, to be pregnant for that long like when you send a sim to a public law and they're pregnant man it's a mess because then you gotta wait like a even longer i love how i love how you save my game literally just crash no Teresa, next time you hear save me you gotta save your game at the same time otherwise who is left for kristen and aaron and lola to end up with uh maybe I don't know. I have to think about it. I have to like look at a list of all the Sims in Strange Town. Oh, he's hitting on me. Hi, AJ. Okay, so these two are just on like a little date right now. You know, I hope they don't get caught, but they haven't done anything romantic yet. They're just on a date. Listen, they could be here as friends. No one knows that from the outside looking in, okay? They also want to eat. Let's have them go and eat some food. Jenny's hungry. My game is on the loading screen. Oh no. They're having a really good day so far. Oh, Kristen's here. Hi, Kristen. We just met someone new as the hostess. Alright, we're gonna have them go and eat. I'm gonna have them order Chef. What is it called? Chef's Choice? Where's the chef at? Uh we don't have a waiter. It's just a wait, why is the why is there oh general bus is here oh no i'm sorry oh no oh shoot oh that's bad that's bad that's bad okay okay they actually don't hate each other that much they really don't hate each other it's just a 47 over a 25 that's it <laughs> That's tough. Um, well, I mean, he hates us already, so might as well just flirt with him some more. <laughs> he already hates us. He already hates us. Just flirt with him some more. Why not? Oh, he's got a crush now. We're going to get caught so easily on these public lots. I got to keep it to the house. We got to keep it to the house. Everyone's watching now. Oh, this is bad. This is bad, y'all. Oh, no. Yikes. Okay, we're gonna do a make out. We're gonna do a make out. I was supposed to have them eat. They did not even eat. Well, let's just do a quick woohoo, I guess. And then that'll complete her want. Oh my gosh, that was my bad. I'm about to swear up once and for all. Oh no. Okay, so there's the three sims. So she made out with three sims. We're gonna have her go and woohoo with AJ now. And he's just sitting and staring, I know. Okay, so there we go. She woohooed with three sims. Perfect. All right, AJ, I'm done with you for now. Maybe I'll come back later, but for now we're, we're done. And then we're gonna have her head on home. So her, her pregnancy timer for the couple of hours we just spent here, it did not advance, which is a very unfortunate. I think he's kind of into humiliation. I don't know. <laughs> he did just sit there and watch. Oh, he's getting, who's getting there? What? AJ is getting his pictures taken in here. Okay. Just by himself. Look at these pictures. He just all by himself. I mean, what's his, his last name is is Loner, so that, that makes sense to me. 
She wants to public woohoo three times now. What? Jenny, you are just, you are something else. She's a, she's a little bit crazy. <laughs> she woohoo with three different sims, made out with three different sims. She's having General Buzz's baby. I mean, this is getting a little out of hand now. All right, we're heading on home. Jenny's midlife crisis era, true. I like how PT9 is like grabbing her, her stomach. Like he thinks it's his. Oops. Oops. He doesn't know. He'll never know. He'll never know. <laughs> Not surprised by AJ one to be alone. All right. So Jenny will get home in four hours. So that's four hours he lost on her pregnancy. Unfortunately, I've just got to wait it out now. Jill is stinking. Go take a shower, girl. I'm gonna have her go and jump rope after that, I think. I'm only really sad they're not Pauls because I love Alien Babies so much. Yeah, they're. I like Alien Babies too. We have a lot in town right now, though. We have Vidkun's new baby, Tycho. We have Astra. We have Johnny. We have Blackwell. We have a lot. It might be nice, actually, to mix in some regular Sims too. What if the child has Buzz's brown hair though? Someone said that Buzz has, uh, or uh, Jenny has a grandma who has brown hair. He's not smart enough to know otherwise. Okay, so Jill is greeting her dad. We're playing around. She wants to play Marco Polo. Did she play Marco Polo with her dad? I don't know. Let's try it out. I feel like PT9 might be a little bit a little bit too old and tired to play with his daughter. Okay, let's see. Can you invite your dad into the pool? Let's have him get in and just have her just swim around a little bit. He's going to take the slide down. Um. Oh, he can. He can. Oh, he's going on the stomach. Ouch. He just belly flopped right in. Ouch. That looked really painful. Okay, let's ask him to play Marco Polo. Don't leave. PC9, please. Here we go. How cute. He's like, he's swimming around, getting away from her. And she just splashed him. Oh, he's hiding under the water. He's hiding from you, Jill. Don't trust him. He's hiding. Marco, you have to call back, Paul. They're like on opposite sides of the pool. I'm like invested in this, in this game right now. <laughs> oh, he's calling back. There he goes. Polo, Marco, Polo, Marco. Come on. Oh, wait, she's getting him. She's getting him. She's coming over. Come on, Jill. You're so close. You're so close. No, PT not. Wait, they just touched. They just touched. I like how she's like, you can still like feeling around. This animation is really cool, actually. Marco, pull. He's getting out. Oh, that little sneak. That little sneak. Look at him. He's getting out. You, you. <laughs> he is so sneaky. Oh, he's jumping back in. She probably heard that splash, you know? That is so cute. I'm actually so invested in the Marco Polo game. I want to know who's going to win. I didn't know like the animations were like this in detail. Like he's like sneaking out of the pool. Jill's like feeling around. So cute. Stop sneaking. PT9, he's sneaking away. I can't stop smiling. This is so adorable. Oh, he's, he's just splashing back in. He keeps getting out. Let her tag you, PT9. Having animation looks like it does. Let her tag you. Come on, give it up. Oh, they're best friends now. How cute. I don't know who won or who lost. I don't know, but PT9's a cheater. That's all I know. Well, not like an actual cheater, but you know, he's he's a cheater because he keeps getting out of the pool. He's exhausted. I know he's exhausted. I'm gonna I'm gonna let him sleep now. Well, that was fun when Jenny was out cheating. Oh, General Buzz is oh hi General Buzz. Haha. <laughs> he's like he's got a dagger over his head. He's so mad at her. Listen, it wasn't that serious, okay? It was not that serious. He's so mad at her. He's still hitting on her though. He cannot he cannot deny how cute she is, even though he's mad at her. Um we can give him our pet. And we can ask him to stay the night. We don't need you to stay the night. Does think you want to play Strange Town? What? Where, where is General Buzz going? He's going into my bedroom where my husband is sleeping. Okay, and he's going to go use my toilet. You couldn't use this toilet over here that's for like company? Guess not. 
Jenny is a cheater. Yes, she had multiple romance wands, unfortunately. Why can't she sleep with him? Hello? She's stuck? Jenny? She cannot sleep in the same bed. Oh, it's the it's because the bed is uh wrong side is claimed, I think, right? Is that why? Can you sleep, please? Jenny, please sleep. There we go. He's mad but still likes her. I'm so confused, I know. Does she have smooth talk? I don't think she does. Oh, is she getting her next bump right now? Oh no, she's still sleeping. Okay. She's getting very hungry though. I gotta kind of watch that. Jill will have her birthday in two days. Why is he just in my bedroom? Why are you in my bedroom? General Buzz. Oh, and AJ left us a nice little flower vase. I'm gonna delete that. Delete the evidence. Okay, I'm gonna wake her up and have her eat something so that she doesn't, uh, you know, miscarry. I don't think that you can get oh yeah that's true it has to be oh he just gave me a hot tub oh jill is like or jenny is jenny is using all of these gifts to her advantage because i just got a hot tub where's my hot tub at where'd it go where is it oh oh that's a good place for it actually that is nice i was asking if they had a hot tub too that is really nice thank you for that first we got a tv for upstairs now we got a hot tub Keep going, Jenny. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Uh, we're getting some good loot, though, from this. Oh, the cat's starving. Shoe, is he? He has food in his bowl, I think. Oh, no, he doesn't. I lied. I lied. Go fill the bowl, please. I'm gonna get him over here. Can't control him. I don't know why. Go eat. Okay, please. Go eat. Both Jenny and the cat are starving. How is AJ for? I wish I knew. I wish I knew perfect for her and loki's eventual affair we'll see i don't know about her and loki i don't know i have to think about it i just don't want his brow bone mixed into jenny's genetics to be honest with you how many hours into her pregnancy um i think it's not that much honestly i think she's only like on her first day maybe let's see 43 hours 43 hours we have like two more days. Yeah, it's a it's a long it's a long time more. Probably just speed three this, just so we can make good timing. The baby's not pollination technicians. No, it's general buzzes. Okay, I'm gonna wake Jenny up to go and get some leftovers. Yeah, ACR is just rubbing it in that it's not Paul's baby. I think tomorrow night she should have her final bump. <clears throat> it's time for Jill to go to school. Come on, Jill. Can't, my game is taking so long to save. All right, there we go. Go to school. And then Jill will age up in two days. Well, tomorrow's her final day. So after that, it'll be her um, birthday. What do they do when they're home alone? It's just like, they're just walking around. Not really doing much. We got 200 simoleons again for child support. We got a pair of bills too. I don't know when PT9 is going to pass. He's 62 days old. I think my Sims live for like 70 something days. I'm not sure though. I can't sleep on the floor. I just forget. I let the animals sleep on the um, furniture and stuff, I think. I mean, it's a cat. It can sleep anywhere it wants, right? I'm like Jenny up so her sleep schedule isn't too messed up. He still has no idea. He fears Jenny dying. That's sad. We're passing it off as Paul's. Yes. It'd be sad if Buzz finally has a daughter and he can't spend time with her. We don't know what it is yet. We don't know what it is yet. Could be a son. Could be a daughter. We don't know. No, but uh, yeah, Jenny's gonna pass it off as, as pollination technicians, yeah. Jill's grades are slipping. S ones in the Sims 3 sleep on the counters and stuff. Isn't that, isn't that Sims 4? All right, she's bringing home Buck again. She's She loves Buck. She's good friends with him. They're best friends. That's so cute. Childhood sweethearts. I'm gonna have her do her homework because she really wants to and she's gonna be right now so why not 
I should have her mom help. Her mom is like doing absolutely nothing besides just sitting there and be, oh, okay. It's another day on the job when Polynesian technician number nine suddenly realizes that he doesn't have any more fish to chum. The current amount of chum will probably feed the animals for half a day. And PT9 was never given instructions on what to do if he ran out of fish. Should PT9 go out and buy more fish to use to chum or use artificial fish food instead? Buy some fish. PT9 runs out and quickly buys as much fish as he can and then returns to chumming. Emergency averted. Upon hearing about potential disaster, PT9's boss appreciates his extra effort and gives him a promotion. Yay! Good job, PT9. I, 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 I'm proud of you. So he's now a dolphin tank cleaner. Where are you going? Oh, she's greeting her dad. Okay, I was going to help you with your homework. All right, well, why don't you go pee and you wait for her to come back up here? She's going to give a hug to her dad. Oh, all right. We're going to send Jill back up here so that Jenny can help her with her homework. PT9 literally just got to work and he's already back. It's amazing. Okay, let's go and help her. Help your daughter with her homework. There we go. Good job. Okay, so we're never going watching television now because she's in a bad mood. <sighs> she's watching TV with her daughter. How cute. Buck has joined us as well. I'm gonna have Jenny make some dinner for everybody. Some mac and cheese. Sounds good. I need a phone call. Let's see what it is. PT9 keeps answering the phone. Oh, it's AJ. PT9's gonna be like, no, who are you? <laughs> My wife is not here. In my head, Buzz has high expectations of his sons and they're all disappointing to him. So I feel like a daughter would just be his princess who does no wrong. That's cute. I like that. Unfortunately, he won't know it's his. <laughs> In the ideal situation, maybe one day he would. Maybe one day he would. If PT9 passes, I might remarry Jenny to him if she gets the want. I may. French watcher, ça va? How are you? I walked away. Was it a boy? No, we haven't. We, she hasn't given birth yet. Too early. It's too early. I'm still waiting on her birth. We can check how many hours pregnant she is right now. Let's see. Let's see. 63. So she has 10 hours left, y'all. 10 hours left. 10 hours left. Jill's birthday is also at 6 p.m. today. Amazing. Okay. I'm excited to see what the, what the baby's gonna look like because I have high expectations because Jenny is stunning. Buzz is good looking. I mean, can't get much better than that, right? <clears throat> they need I didn't even prepare like a nursery or anything. I should turn Johnny's old room into a nursery, right? That just makes sense. Okay, let's delete some of this garbage on the walls. All of Johnny's old things. Just delete them all. He doesn't need them. He lives in that mansion with Ophelia now. So he doesn't he doesn't need them. Alright, where am I gonna put a crib? We, I gotta decide where this stuff is gonna go. Oh, this has like objects on it. Let me delete those. Paul just died in your game. <laughs> you're so so sad i don't know why i just don't have a connection to him maybe it's because i'm like speed throwing everything i like jenny more than like paul i don't know i mean he's okay but not my maybe not my cup of tea perhaps okay so i'm gonna make her bedroom like a green but i'm not gonna do it like the rest of the houses i'm gonna do like a special wallpaper let's find something special nice special wallpaper maybe like this she likes the color green you gotta remember that you got to remember that green is her favorite color i'm gonna move this in the middle of the room and i'm going to also put the crib in here they have a this is a really big baby room so we have lots of space um 
Um, I cannot place this down. What is going on? I don't like how it clips the curtains. Now, I'm gonna put this here and then just like spread the baby stuff out. Thanksgiving's gonna be awkward. I think it's probably the, that's the trauma of seeing Paul's reptile eyes. I could not with those default eye replacements. That was crazy. That was crazy. I cannot believe that they looked like that. I've never used those before, so it was a little, it was a little shocking to say the least. Okay, a little, little shocking to me. Baby Jade in a green room would be so fun. I know. If it's a girl, Jade. If it's a boy, Jack. Jade and Jack. It's gotta, it's gotta be a four letter Jade name. It has to. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta disobey our naming convention system for the baby name for this one around because she likes she likes the j names okay so i'm gonna put on a little rug little area rug and i love this rug if you can't tell i put it in like every single house i have so that's that's my bad if you keep seeing it over and over and over again you probably you probably have i'm gonna put down some stuff i know this like isn't the cutest baby room i'm not really i'm not trying too much i might center that in the middle of the room and then put like a painting on the wall potentially isn't there like a baby isn't like a baby shelf or something like that i'm trying to think oh this could be cool when the kid gets a little older maybe something like this i don't know could fall on the baby which is kind of a bad thing but kind of a bad thing just kind of a bad thing <laughs> oh let's get this measuring stick too it's space theme too that's cool all right there's a baby room. Baby's coming soon. Johnny, after finding out his mother was seeing Buzz. How unfortunate, but where's my brother? <laughs> Isn't hating each other's guts just a part of being siblings? What happened to his eyes? So I had default eye replacements and they looked really creepy for aliens. It was just like something to do with alien eyes. So I had to change them because they were spooky. Oh, I think it's time. Maybe? yep here we go i think right no oh jenny come on you baited me <laughs> she baited me i thought i thought she was gonna give birth she's like moving and like pt9's even like looking at her and stuff like that so do i have a story about this family no no story i'm just playing them jenny baited me y'all jenny baited me i'm gonna pt9 and clean up a little bit i'm trying to get like her in an open area so we can kind of get a good look when the baby's born it's any any minute now any minute now jenny any minute now she's like looking at me like come on i want this baby out of me as much as you do <laughs> i mean when i think about it it's kind of a toxic relationship to begin with considering paul literally abducted her dad and forced him to have his alien baby. i mean that's yeah that's the aliens that's a whole that's a whole um what's it called ethical ethicality debate uh with the aliens in this game the whole alien system all right, wait, is it time? No, you're giving me jokes. I don't want jokes. I want the baby to be born. No jokes, just pure children. Oh, he's feeling the baby. Rebelly. <clears throat> Talk to belly. <laughs> That's not my baby in there, but I'm gonna pretend like it is. Yay. All right, come on, Jenny. Any, she's gotta be giving. Me, oh my gosh, that scared me. Thank you, Katie. I appreciate it. Only jokes, no child. Only jokes, no child. That's so true. Seventy-two hours. Any minute now. Come on, Jenny. Give birth to the baby. Give birth to the baby. Oh my gosh, she's peeing. She's peeing every twenty seconds. Real, real trials and tribulations of being a pregnant woman in The Sims. Jill's walking out like I'm done. <laughs> She's been 72 hours pregnant. She should be she should be well into giving birth by now. Oh, apparently PT9's gaining some fame. They're just gonna sit here making out with each other, I guess. I'm having her eat. I guarantee the moment she starts eating, she gives birth. Ready? Ready? You guys ready for it? It's always my bad timing. Okay, I lied. I lied. She did not give birth. <laughs> She's still still come on, Jenny. Do some squats. Do something. Okay, now she's lounging. I'm just gonna wait. I'm just gonna chill here. Oh, oh, she's getting up. Nope, she's gonna go and hug her husband. Why is this game? Oh, oh my gosh, here we go. Oh, I was sped, I, I sped three it too quickly. Oh, two babies? Uh, choose whose baby? Jenny Smith. Oh my gosh, two babies, two babies. Okay, so 
just for you guys back at home uh, who are watching on Twitch, whatever is the first baby on the list is if I choose if it's a boy or a girl. So I can't choose both boy and girl. It has to be either one or the other for their prediction. Okay, anyway, let's see. So the top one is a baby girl. Baby girl. Oh, and they're little blonde babies. How cute, does he know? He doesn't know, does he? No, he doesn't know. He has no idea. It says baby girl Smith. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. All right, go give it. Go give the baby to your husband. Wait, stop, stop making food, PC9. Okay, so I'm going to choose girl. Let's do prediction. Let me give you guys your points. There everyone goes. Here we go. She's giving birth to another one. <laughs> both little blonde babies. And they're both girls anyway. So it was, it was... The, it was gonna be girls anyway here we go twin twin girls so i need j names one of them's got to be a girl and preferably things to do with green and it's got to be four letters four letters no pt9 does not know pt9 does not know that these are not his babies he has no idea jade yes jade is the top one iris i wanted i wanted a j name judy J four letter girl name. Judy could be cute. June, Jane, Jada, Jewel. Four letter. June. June. I'm seeing a lot of June. I mean, PT9 used to abduct and impregnate humans as a living. That's true. Junie's cute. I like Junie. Junie. I think Junie is my fave. June. A lot of you guys are saying June. June because June bugs are green. <laughs> we either do Junie or June. That's what I'm caught between. I think I'm seeing more um, Junes, so I can do June. All right, Jade and June Smith. Here we go. Okay, so you guys know I have this age old tradition. She wants to have 10 kids. My goodness, Jenny. I'm going to save. And then I have, this, I have this tradition on my channel where we age them up to see what they would look like when they get older. So I'm going to save here. And then we're going to age them up and then we're gonna leave the save so obviously they won't be like adults because i'm like i have to know what they're gonna look like when they age up because i feel like they're gonna be very beautiful i have an inkling all right we're gonna age up baby june and baby jade age them up come on game okay pt9 <laughs> okay it's your responsibility age the babies up please all right age up june I like her hair. It's cute. Wait, why? Okay, age up June. Okay, there we go. And then we're going to age to adult June. And then we're going to age to adult Jade. Oh! Look at her! Oh, her face is kind of long. Hold on a sec. Let me see her. Let me see her in a... Let me see her in a... Let me see here. Okay, so here is here's June. I don't know. Her her eyes are very close. <laughs> but there she is. And then here's her twin. Where's her twin? At? Her twin's a lot prettier than her. I'm sorry to say, but she is. Let's see. Yeah, she oh my goodness! She is cute. Jade. Jade is the cute one. Jade is stunning. Look at her. Yeah, she's cute, cute. She's a good looking sim. Unfortunate eye placement, yeah. It's because I think Buzz has the has closer together eyes. She's pretty though. Picture. I'm scared for June. She's pretty, but something is off. <laughs> That's so funny. That's a very funny comment. But yeah, here's uh here's June. This is what she looks like. Jada looks Jade. Sorry, Jada. Jade looks a lot like Jada. Yes, she does. PT9 is um or pc9 <sighs> june looks more like buzz jade looks more like jenny for sure okay so there we go we gotta look at the twins i'm going to do you want to save no i don't want to save if june's eyes are a bit bigger i think it'd be okay yeah i love this skin thank you it's um it's honey honey by leah lilith yeah, it, those are those are general buzz grunts babies. Yes, she she she's a cheater. Jenny is a cheater, unfortunately. 
Mm. I mean, yeah, they both look good, but she's... Uh, I think I'm going to have some favoritism towards Jade. <laughs> I'm sorry to say. Okay, so now we need another crib. I can't believe she had twins. That's so exciting. I do use mods. Yes, I do. I use a lot of mods. Lots of mods. Um, okay, so we need two changing tables. Actually, no, we don't. Why, why, am, I, why am I trying to do two? We don't... No, we don't need two changing tables. Uh, we need two cribs is what we need. I want to put them like side by side. Let's see. Put this right here. This one here. Uh, something's in the way. What's in the way? Move. Oh, oh, oh. My rug is like glitching out. Okay. I'm going to put the these toys on like opposite sides of the room so that they don't, the kiddos don't like clip it into each other. And I'm going to do a dollhouse too. I'm going to give them like a lot of toys, I think. Give them a lot of toys. Um, is there no other? Can I not recolor? There's no recolors for this dollhouse. Okay, I'll have to download some for sure. I'm going to do a toy box, toy chest. This one. And going to put oh i love this object this is my favorite object this is from the sims 4 but it's a conversion to the sims 3 they can go in here and play i think they can they can use this and play it's so cool but it's kind of a huge object i'm sure as you can tell it's very it's a huge object um maybe i can shove it in the corner of the room no i'm gonna just put this in there are they gonna be able to use this probably not the sims 2 is very finicky when you try and have them use like objects that are way too close to each other. I mean, that's kind of understandable. Oh my gosh. Sometimes the noises and my headphones are too loud. Thank you for the hydration, Maddie. I appreciate it. Be watching your videos instead of going outside. Yes. <laughs> All right, so there are the babies. I'm gonna save once again. And then we're gonna put the babies in their nursery. All right, so who do you have in your hands? You have June. I'm gonna go upstairs and put June upstairs. And then PT9 probably has Jade, so I'll have him grab Jade. Where is Jade? Is she on the floor? Yep, she's on the floor. Nice job. My favorite twin, Jade, is on the floor. <laughs> Wonder if Jenny and Paul will have a kid. Now we'll have to see, to see. She does wanna have 10 babies, so she needs to get to work on that. Now, she wants to woohoo with three different sims in public. I wonder if we just have her invite. Wait, does that mean it needs to be three new sims? No, I think it's counted differently, right? I did raise the risky woohoo and what? Why is the why is the kitty starving? Oh my goodness. The kitty is starving. Don't kiss him. Go feed your kitty. Yes, I raised the price of the wish risky woohoo and the driver baby. I'm sorry, I had to. I had to, after Pleasant View, I'm traumatized of children in this game. <laughs> I am absolutely traumatized. Angela and Lilith 2.0. <laughs> Risky, ooh, price increase, the stock, the sock market. Oh, that's funny. That is funny, Will. You are funny. The sock market is in shambles. <laughs> oh, someone's gotta go to work. Oh, it's Paul. Okay, Paul's going to work. I'm downloading the Sims 2 Ultimate Collection. Did I did I inspire you? <laughs> did I inspire you? Okay, so tonight is Jill's birthday, I think, right? When they have one day left over, that means that you throw them their birthday when they have one day left, right? I haven't played I haven't played the Sims 2 in like a week and a half, so I'm a little I'm not remembering things. I did inspire you. I'm glad. <laughs> because you won't i do feed it i keep feeding the cat he just he just eats the food so quickly jill is doing extremely well in school it's good let's um let's get the kitty a bed now that will said something about how i don't give the kitty a bed i'll give the kitty a bed let's give him this one give, give the kitty a green bed it's gotta be a green bed i love that these are on the wall because obviously they're like Johnny and Jill's little pictures and stuff like that from school. Hi, Jenny. What are you doing? She's cooking a hamburger. What's my favorite bands? 
um it changes like if you ask me tomorrow i would tell you someone different but when i was in high school i really loved arctic monkeys and i had like an arctic monkey shirt i don't know where it went and i'm really sad i can't find it because i would still wear it to this day i love arctic monkeys always have i love lana del rey i will always love lana del rey i've loved her also since i was in like high school maybe even like middle school probably i love the green theme yes gotta do a green theme i kind of want to show jill her younger sisters do i want to know qc what is qc is that quebec quebec city is that what qc is on the 15th will she show up late though that's a question <laughs> that's a joke that's a joke okay she is late to like a lot of her gigs though which kind of sucks i love lana but like you gotta admit like being late to a gig is kind of like rude to the fans that waited for you i love lana but i gotta say that okay jill does not care that she has younger sisters um she had a good memory for it though um oh you, you're going to bed good night may bonsoir <clears throat> I'm waiting for a tour it's hard to yeah i know it, it's i saw something about it on um on reddit and i was like that's a good point like it's it's kind of rude and to the fans that waited for you you know to be late to your own gig i don't know yeah jill does not care that she just got two younger sisters she she really doesn't <laughs> just not care the way Jill reacted, like, exactly my older sister. <laughs> she can't- I wish, like, Simmas could go up to the crib and, like, peek in and, like, wave at the baby. Like, children at least. That'd be really cool. Why is Paul making so little money? He's making, like, 83 simoleons a day. That is really low. Very, very low. The baby crying is why I don't play the sound anymore. It's worse than The Sims 3, I feel like. In The Sims 3, the crying is just- it's unbearable to me. I don't know why. It's, like, a lot worse for me in The Sims 3. Okay, so Jenny has a wand. We're gonna, I'm gonna try and spend the next 20 minutes completing her want to, first of all, have 10 children, and two, public woohoo with three event sims. So, oh, thank you, Liz. Thank you so much. I haven't seen you in a while, Liz. How have you been? Hi, Maddie. Hi, Liz. I love that Jenny's daughters are younger than, Bra than Blackwell, her grandson, I know. They had, I feel like they had Johnny pretty, or well, Jenny had Johnny pretty young, I think. Strange Town Recession. Hey, Jenny, is PT9? No, PT9's not available to talk. Okay, so uh, what we have to do is Jenny needs to woohoo with three different Sims in public. This can get really, really messy because it's in public, so like it can be anyone there. I'm gonna have her try and ask. I know General Buzz like hates her right now but their relationship is not negative at least on jenny's side so we'll see if she picks up or he picks up for a date no he does not okay he does not want a date so in that case we're gonna ask out aj we're gonna ask out aj next because aj will pick up he will accept her let's see um community lot we're gonna do this real quick because I'm trying to get these I'm trying to get these wishes out of the way as fast as possible. And then we also need to get PT9 out to a public lot as well because he's going to be one of the sims that she woohoo's with as well. So we have to we, we got to wait. She's with AJ too. She's with AJ. What? Are these bad? Oh, the we need a gardener. We don't make we don't really make any money, but but we need a gardener. I'm going to have him go over to the phone and Grab a grab a gardener from the services. Good morning. Good morning to wherever you are in the world. Okay, Jenny, 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 get in the car, please. Okay, thank you. They can miss the date and it's really annoying. They don't give you enough time sometimes. If you take a taxi, do a public lot, it's so annoying. And then the date will be like, why'd you stand me up? Da -da -da. It's like, oh my god, shut up. <laughs> shut up. Oh shoot, it is Jill's birthday. Hopefully Jenny can get this over with real quick. Hopefully Jenny can get this over with real quick. Cause we got two hours till J 
Jill. <laughs> I don't know what I was trying to say. Jill ages up. I tried to say, I think I tried to say Jenny and then it came out. I don't know. There's lots of J names in this. No, we can do this. I believe we can do this in two hours. I believe in us. I believe in us. All right. So what we need to do is we're going to go over to Woohoo in the photo booth really quickly. Really quickly. They're not even going to kiss. They're not even going to talk. They're just going to go right to the photo booth. And that will be one person, one sim for her public Woohoo want. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Okay. And there's that. And then we're going to end the date. I'm sorry. I have to cut it short. I got to get home to my daughter's birthday. I gotta go, AJ. Goodbye. Is there even an ACR spawner in the slot? I don't think there is. Is there? Oh, there is. Perfect. Okay. You're gonna go home. Taxi's coming soon. We have like 30 minutes. I mean, oh, oh, Johnny's here. <gasps> Johnny just rolled up. Oh, John. Oh, that's Tank. I thought it was General Buzz. Why do they? They have the same haircut. That's amazing. Okay. No, do not. Do not hug him. Do not hug him. Do not. Your son is right there. Your son is right there. Do not hug him. I repeat, do not hug AJ Loner. He does not deserve a hug. Johnny's here. I just cleaned my dog's ears and he's really making sure that he makes me regret it. I've never cleaned when I had a dog a while ago. We never cleaned our ears. I thought it was I thought it was um buzz, but it was tank. They have the same haircut, so I guess it's not hard to mix them up. Alright, so we will make Jenny uh Jill's birth. If I say Jenny one more time when I mean to say Jill, I'm going to lose my mind. What is this at the edge of the lot? What was that? What was that? I don't know what that was. Okay, so we're gonna call it gardener. My mom just asked me if I was good since I screamed Johnny. <laughs> Tell your mom, no, <laughs> I'm not good. I'm having a crisis. Okay, uh, let's grab these. Oops, I clicked the wrong button. I did not mean to click that button. Oopsie, let's do this. <clears throat> Gotta wait till Jenny's home to throw a Jill a birthday party. I mean, we're not gonna be throwing any party. It's not gonna be party. PT9 wants to invite someone over, so I think I'm going to have him invite over Johnny, because I think Johnny will come over. Let's see if we can invite over just their whole family. Hey, bring, the, bring the baby with you. We can't bring the baby, unfortunately. Should we bring Cerberus? No, we won't bring Cerberus. Just, just Ophelia and Johnny is good. It'll be a little, a little party for a family. And then Johnny gets to meet his younger sisters too, which is cool. Okay, they both need to be fed. This will be nice too because then we can have Jill help out with the babies. Yeah, that's what we need to do. Okay, Johnny's home. Jill, go and invite your brother inside, please. Um, Johnny's hitting on Ophelia, just like everyone else in this town is. <laughs> Literally, Ophelia is like who's like a who's like a super attractive woman that everyone like fawns over. I don't know. Insert person here. <laughs> everyone in town has a giant crush. Laszlo, Johnny, just everyone. Everyone loves Ophelia. And I mean, can, can you blame them? Okay. All right, we need to go and buy a cake from Chill. And then eat her up. Let's go. Blow out candles. Come on. Just let's, let's get this over with. At least, at least she did not miss her birthday. Her mom did not miss her birthday. That's nice. Happy birthday, Jill. Don't forget AJ. What do you mean, don't forget AJ? Don't forget AJ what? Why is even the baby's here on the grounds? <laughs> now that you're a teen, here are children to take care of. Yes. <laughs> Jill will be taking care of her younger siblings. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm not sorry, okay? He swooned. Oh, AJ, yes. AJ swooned over Ophelia. Yes. Everyone loves Ophelia. She's like the it girl. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yes. And boom. Each dub. Oh, yeah. Is she popularity? Is that what she rolls? Popularity? Okay, we'll, we'll give her popularity. So we need to roll number one through four so I can choose a hair color for her. I'm going to go to number generator. She got a one, which means she likes 
blonde hair guess who has blonde hair buck buck has blonde hair and she does not like charismatic men i guess or women i don't know she looks exact she does okay so let's check her sexuality now that she aged up so jill is a straight love that's so funny that she has she likes blonde hair she got that rolled that's cute <clears throat> baby celebrating yes the baby is celebrating oh okay you age right up to a teen and you fall asleep on your cake yes wouldn't she be related to book because they share two siblings not technically i guess no no they just that just means they share a sibling I don't think that means that they're related. That just means they share a sibling. <laughs> it's bad, yes, but this is my headcanon, so it has to happen. Okay, she likes pink, I think. I don't know. Um, her room is pink, so I'm gonna assume she likes pink. So I'm gonna give her like pink clothes. Let's give her pink stuff. Like this is cute. Maybe some shorts. Are they I don't I don't want the shorts to clip on the dress. Okay, we'll do this. There we go. And here's her outfit. Cute. And let's give her some makeup. I kind of want to change her hair because I'm sick of the pigtails. She's had the pigtails for so long. Let's just give her like maybe a ponytail or something. Her face is, I don't know. It's like with Jenny as her mom, I would expect her to be prettier. But you know what? I should stop being judgmental. She's fine. I think Erin will forever be like my favorite sim in this town just i mean visually my favorite sim because she's just so pretty now, honestly jenny would probably be after aaron because jenny is really she's 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 a stunner she's like a supermodel stunner okay let's give her some eye details some face details i mean maybe some eyeliner in her waterline and i think that'll pretty much do it here for chill have anything else i want to give her i don't think there we go okay <clears throat> make her a swifty <laughs> bright red lips <laughs> okay i'm gonna have her go and sleep there's a baby crying who is it okay it is jade so we need to put june in the crib we're gonna go and grab jade do you have genetically accurate sims in the save yes i do um, not everyone though. Not everyone is genetically accurate, but most Sims, I did like a, quite a few of them. I, I corrected. I think I did. I can't remember who I did. <laughs> I'm blanking, but I said it like in the original Strange Time video who I did. The outing was great yesterday. I thought I'd get you this titanium. He brought me, he brought me alcohol, <laughs> a toasting set. Let's toast to Jill's birthday. Yay. I need to also delete this flower because this is like bad. We can't, we can't, we can't show. Are we going to give her a quick room makeover? I kind of like like the pink. I don't know. It just, it just feels, oh, I'll delete the, I'll delete the dollhouse. But this, if the room is like screaming, I just went from like a child to a teen, you know? I know my room when I was a kid, like for a long time, even when I was a teenager, it looked still kind of childish because I just never updated it. I kind of like that look. I don't know. Okay, so she just fed Jade. I'm going to put Jade back in the crib. And we almost, we almost finished a whole rotation with these guys. Like we were so close, y'all. We were so close. We almost did it. Actually, I think we can do it. Can I finish a day in the next seven minutes? I think we can. Okay, she's saying goodbye to her son and his wife. But he's also sick. Isn't her hobby film and literature? I, I would have to check. We can check right now with that box. If I keep going into the cast, then we're never gonna finish the day or the rotation. I really wanna finish the rotation though. I'm like, I'm got my mind. Yeah, film and literature for uh, Jill is her favorite. Oops, I grabbed the countertop. wonder if you could put any blonde boy heartthrob posters up. I don't know what's available in The Sims. I don't know if there's any male posters. I know there's an alien one, like an alien with no clothes on. It looks really weird, actually. But I like the, I like the, let's see if we can recolor this one to a heartthrob. 
Oh, here we go. Here we go. Heartthrob. There's a heartthrob right there. I don't know who this is, but there we go. <laughs> he has he has like brownish hair, so it's not quite her type. She likes she likes blonde guys. It will be Buck. It will be Buck, I swear. All right, I'm waking up Jenny. I'm gonna have her go in. We have her go and take care of the babies. Oh, I guess not. No. Oh my gosh, her bladder is going low so fast, y'all. <gasps> Oh, it's because she's sick, I think, right? I don't know. I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay, she's not pregnant with the Aegis baby. Oh, that was uh, that was almost scary. That was almost scary, y'all. Oh, shoot. Jenny has to go to work. All right, PT9, it's your time. It's your time to be father of the year and, and swoop in. Oh, and the toilet broke. Oh, no. Everything is just collapsing. Everything is just falling apart in this house. Okay, okay, okay. Put June back. We're gonna hold Jade, change Jade's diaper. And then the baby's age up tonight, actually. Jill just got up, she's very sleepy. <clears throat> I don't know when we need to have the nanny track his um track his work schedule. Actually, no, Jenny will be home before he leaves, so that's fine. Okay, is the kitty okay? Yes, the kitty's okay for once. We're good, everything's good. Kitty's not hungry for the first time in the kitty's life. I kept forgetting to feed the kitty. <clears throat> uh, there's some CC that's great for teen rooms, teen singers, and boy bands and all that. That'd be fun. I don't know where they are. Are they in like... Where they at? Let's see. Maybe I put them above her bed or her computer? We can put them on both sides of her computer. Let's see. What do we got? We got these interesting Picasso paintings. Just kidding. Uh, here's one of them. Teenager. I don't know. It's called... It's called Engineered Angst. That's the name of that poster. Here's another poster. Oh, here's a guy. Okay. Here's some... Let me put moved objects on so we can like stack them on top of each other. Here's another like rock band. What else we got? We got another rock band here. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put this on the other side of the computer. Let's do it right there. Um, here's a werewolf. I don't know about that. It might scare her. Here's another rock band type poster. There we go. All right. Here's some posters for her for her room. <laughs> Jill is like me when I show up to college in that same outfit, like her PJs, but usually like hair around a coffee cup with coffee. Jenny is the brandy of this town. Ten kids. We'll see. She's getting a little old here, guys. She's got nine days. PT9 doesn't have much longer, I don't think. Why is she not at school? Oh, it's Saturday. What am I saying? She wants to buy a cell phone. We could do that. Have her go to her computer and buy a little cellular cellular phone. Uh, we'll go to shop online. Buy a cell phone. What if Jill was like punk in pink? Punk pink? World poster might scare her. Her dad is looking an alien, Maddie. <laughs> That's true. Uncle Laszlo's calling. Oh, she wants to go to college! Yay, of course. Of course, these two are kissing. How oh, sweet. Let's go and take care of the babies, shall we, Jenny? There's PT9. Oh, PT9 doesn't work today. Okay, good. Well, he can help us with, with babies then. That's thank you for that, PT9. Being such a good dad to these ch child children. <clears throat> we gotta feed. Who, who does he have? He has June. Okay, so the kiddos are gonna age up to toddlers. Or no, this is Jade. Oh, I'm never gonna get them straight. I'm never gonna get them straight. It's gonna be so difficult for me. Battle to Jade. And you have June, so you can put June in the crib. Okay, I'm gonna have her go to the bathroom. Go to sleep, maybe take a nap. I don't know. Go just go, go rest. Go take a rest, Jenny. Okay, everyone just gained another. Did I just see that right? Did everyone just gain another day, like at 4 p.m.? That that's that should not be happening. They should be gaining days at midnight. Hmm. 
I'm not sure if I saw that right. I heard I only heard the noise, so I'm a little I'm a little scared. Okay. Actually, Jenny, don't go to bed. I'm sorry. I gotta age up these twins. Have him grab her. What's that clipping noise? I hear like someone clipping things. Is it her in her diary, maybe? She's she's writing in her diary, that's what it is. Okay, let's age up. Who's this baby? This is Jade. We're going to put her down. Can I age her up? No, I have to use Sim Blender. Where is it? Where is it at? Did I put one down in here? I did not. Nice job, Maddie. You forget things. You're just so forgetful. Phantom noise. You guys hear? I heard like scissors. I heard scissors, like scissor clipping things. Okay, so let's age up Jade. And then you grab June. Okay, so there's Jade. And let's scrub June. She has cute little space buns. I like that. I don't have a lot of toddler hairs. I gotta get some more. Okay, here's baby June. There we go. And there we go. There are the babies. Okay, so then someone wanted to see their zodiac. So let's look at Jade. Jade is a cancer. This is Jade. Yeah, Jade's a cancer. And who are you? June is a Capricorn. No, it's an Aries. Sorry. It's, sim it's similar. It's similar. So there we go. Um, let's. Oh, the gardener. Yes, you're you're right. That's what it is. That is what it is. Here it is. Here's the noise. <laughs> you are right. Thank you. I forgot I hired a gardener. So a Capricorn in my game would. Or no, Cap I said Capricorn. It's an Aries. It's an Aries and it's a ca uh, Cancer is family and Aries is romance. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Jenny's hacking up a lung. Well, guys, I think I am going to end our Wednesday stream there. That was really fun. I This is, a, this is the first time I ever streamed on a Wednesday and I really enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think. A lot of people came and watched, so I really appreciate that. A lot of you I met for the first time tonight, so that's super fun. And thank you everyone that um, made it for the first ever Wednesday stream. But I will see you guys on Saturday now, so a couple days from now. I will see y'all. And we're playing The Sims 3. So, yeah, see you guys Saturday. Bye!